Hello and welcome once again to Mr. G and Martin's Super Vaping Reviews and it's good to be back. What do you think, Martin? Yeah. Martin. Martin. I'm in, I'm in pain, Colin. What do you mean you're in pain? I'm in pain. Don't tell us you're in pain because your head's killing you. No. You've got a splitting headache? No, not like that. Well, why are you in pain? My scrotum's come loose. You what? My scrotum. Martin's scrotums just don't come loose. Well, mine has. Martin, that's your scrotum. I know, it's there, isn't it? Hey, Martin, it's time for the gloves. Can you put it back on for me, Carl, please? Martin, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Put it back on. But Martin, just don't put a scrotum on. But first of all, I've seen this on films, you know. On hospital films, they always put the gloves on. How are you going to do it, Carl? Martin, all you have to do is close your eyes and think of good things. Uh, good uh, things like vaping on a Sunday afternoon. I've got... Look at that, Martin. I'm vaping, I'm vaping. Since last time we saw you, we've had lots and lots of emails. But before we get to the emails, Martin, what have you got that on your head for? It's to keep the air out of my little skull. It's to keep the air out of your... Out of my ears, yes. Out of your ears, yes, yeah. yeah. Wonderful. Back to the emails. Some of the emails we've had, in fact, we've had quite a lot of emails, is, is Martin male or female? As you saw earlier on, his scrotum did fall off, and we've... Put it back. The emails all suggested, why can't we hear Martin? How come you have such a powerful voice? And he talks like, <laughs> and everybody's wondering why, Martin. It's not because I'm a female. It's we know that. So tonight, I'm just we spoken. are going to do a review using wireless radio microphones. And with these, you will hear every little whisper from his lips. And so we get the best quality. We'll be using a few of them. So now, Martin, you have no excuse not to be heard. Like a little teapot mouse. <laughs> these are the babies. These are the beauties. And now, Martin, we're going to bring you into the 21st century. Da -da -da. Martin is now wired up for sound. And it amazes me, Colin. This 20th century to technology. Stop there. It really does. Stop there. 21st century technology. 21st, yeah. And by the way, where do I put this? Well, you don't put it in me. This is wireless, this. So you don't need this? Right. Diamond Mist we're going to review. And this is the Diamond Mist starter kit. That's your electric cigarette there. And in here we have all the different e-liquids. There's 10... Well, there was ten of them. Martin, there's nine here. Where's the tenth? It was so good, Colin, I vaped a lot. You know, Martin, you're just greedy. I'm not greedy. With... You're greedy. It's like with the lagers and everything. You're just greedy. You've just got to have one more than everybody else. Or we used to say in the old days, a potato more than a pig. That was so nice, that one. Well, which was the one that you actually uh, yeah. vaped? Tobacco flavour, it was. Tobacco flavour. Right, seeing you've used it, what was it like? It was excellent. In the sense, excellent of what? Compared to what? Compared to cigarettes. I'd rather smoke that than cigarettes. That is the truth. That the thing about cool. these, by the way, these diamond mist... Um, Liquids. Very inexpensive. Very inexpensive. So, of course, we're not expecting the greatest thing in the world, but we're expecting you're going to get your money's worth. Even some of the expensive ones from the big manufacturers, some of them aren't that great. But this one is very inexpensive. I'll say it again, Diamond Mist. Uh, Martin's already smoked one. There were ten in here. There's only nine. I'm going to look at a few of them, and I'm going to give you my opinion on the aromas. Oh, lovely. Oh, smashing. That's the way to do it. Oh, Rip the box up. Presents. Yes. It's to go back in the window tomorrow with a broken <laughs> box. Oh, look at this. Ooh, oh, look, look at, at this. Oh, go on. Look at Open that it now. Like case. My do you gosh. like that? Right, Are you going to break the zip? The one, the good. thing, I'll tell you the thing about this that I like. This is a really nice carrying case. It certainly is, Colin. I would think you could, you know, some of the carrying cases. Let's get it out, let's get it out. Let's get it out, Martin, get it out. Colin's got a user manual. The user manual. Right, that's my user. 
the atomizer. Shall I take this out, Martin? Yeah, get it out, Colin. It unscrews part of the way, Colin, and then you pull it. Just like that? Yeah, and that's where you put your... So it's e nice and tight at the beginning. The e liquid goes in there. Oh, so right. I had to put it in the money show. Which one are you going to... Could you do with the pineapple one for me? Pineapple. Pineapple's my favourite. Is that pineapple yellow? So while we are waiting for it to soak up into the wick, I've got the little bottle here, and believe it or not, what do you think? Pineapple. This is even before we start to vape it. You know what this reminds oh, me of, Martin? Smell it from here. You know what this reminds me of? You know when you go to weddings, and your little nose is like this, because you, you can smell the pineapple coming from the buffet, and the pineapple's always there with a piece of cheese and a cocktail stick through it. And a bit right? of sausage. No. You don't have sausage with pineapple, do you? What wedding have you ever been with have had a sausage, pineapple and cheese with a cocktail stick through it? No way. But you always have the cheese and the pineapple and you can smell it as you go into the room. You know why? Because it's fresh. It's cool. You remember when we went to your Auntie Maureen's wedding? Moira. All oh, right, then, your Auntie Moira. Moira yeah. And she had, didn't she? Yeah. She had... Pineapple with the cheese, but she didn't have cocktail sticks in it, did she? Yeah. You know what your Auntie Maureen had? Air clips. Air grips. Oh, yes. And I'll tell you something else. There weren't new air grips because I kept getting red hairs in my mouth. <laughs> and your Auntie... There was sausage on it, though. There wasn't sausage on it. I'm sure there was, Carl. Well, if I had sausage on mine, I think somebody's pooed on it then because <laughs> they don't have... You don't have... You don't have sausages. It was sausage. I saw it. I remember seeing you, it. Okay, back to this. Oh, it might have been Martin. Uh, um, back to the diamond mess. Ham and pineapple. Ham and pineapple. Yeah. I'm sick of hearing about bloody weddings. Yeah, you know. All right, yeah. Forget the weddings. Anyway. Back By to now, one. this should have soaked. Are we ready? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Do that again. Do that Definite again. Pineapple. That. Do that again. Just. Chill, like we used to do. Chill, and let's just take in the vapour. Are we ready? Yep. Now, it. now. Oh, yeah, lovely pineapple. <sighs> I like pineapple. And you know something else that you didn't realise? You're enjoying this, aren't you? And you're also a bit of a nicotine man, aren't you? This has no nicotine. And you were still enjoying it. Yeah. I was enjoying it. It wasn't offensive. This would be nice just after you'd had a, a meal or with a coffee and a biscuit. Oh, yeah, definitely. So for the price you're going to pay for this out there, I personally would give this 8 out of 10. You, Martin? Probably a name from me. Can't and remember, you? nobody's paying us for this. We bought these. So it's for the price, result, this. as good as anything. Mind you, pineapple is a bit safe. It's a safe bet, it's pineapple. So from Martin and I, eight out of ten. I, I love either. smelling you, do you know? Pineapple. It's all in your clothes as well. You smell like one big pineapple.